It is my, my precious. <laughs> yes, precious. So I was all set to use this for the project today when I remembered I've got this collection over here of all these weird things that I'm supposed to dip in resin. Okay, and in this bin, one of the things that I did last year was this. This is a toilet paper roll that I stabilized. So after it was stabilized in the stabilizing chamber for a day and then it soaked for two days, I smashed it down so I could fit it into my toaster oven and when it came out I made a cut on my bandsaw. It's definitely hard material um, but it's, it's, not, it's not rock hard so I, I kind of dismissed it at the time thinking it really wasn't what I wanted. But now that we're right in the middle of this whole crazy toilet paper shortage, uh, it, it seems silly not to try to use it for something. And I'm gonna put this back in the house. here and you forgot the toilet paper I'm gonna go get the toilet paper all right so I wasn't really sure what to expect in here this is the tube and it got smashed and there's large pockets where the resin accumulated it's really odd looking that's interesting I wonder why I decided it wasn't gonna work because it feels pretty good maybe it maybe it hardened up over time Okay, I think all the milling operations are complete. I've got a nice sheet of material here that we can make something out of. It is a half inch thick and four inches square. I was thinking like a pendant would look cool. So um, I'm thinking I should just go print out that shape because my drawing skills are abysmal. I don't know why it feels like it looks like jicama to me I, I don't know why it's giving me that vibe but it totally does it totally looks like like jicama um, okay so we've got a shape and all we need now is a hole in the center Definitely getting a teepee vibe here. 
there we go. We've definitely got um, toilet paper curls. And they're shiny with resin, so I guess that means it's all the way through. in these areas right here. This would be the time to have a small strip sander. I don't have one of those. So I don't have anything small enough to get into these little edges here. So I'm just going to try to clean them up with my knife. I do have this one area where I, I kind of over nibbled here. You can see that on the bandsaw. I kind of took a little too much out. So I'm going to See if I can't smooth it out a little bit. Making a toilet paper pendant and I'm still worried about it being perfect. There's that little thing in my brain that keeps telling me you could do better. And it's good. It's a, it's a good voice to have for a lot of things. It's helped me a lot in my life. But uh, it's not useful for this particular thing. Actually, now's the perfect time to talk about this. Have you ever seen this? I bought this from another YouTuber, Jocko. Uh, his channel is called Jocko Whatever, and he makes these. They're called Maker Knives. And it's just a razor blade holder. But man, this thing is so cool. It goes in and out with the power of one finger. And it's got a belt clip. And it's just... If you're talking about supporting other makers right now, uh, head over and check out Jocko's uh, Maker Knife. This thing is just incredibly sexy and it holds a razor blade, which is something we use all the time. So, right there. Okay, I'm gonna go drill a quick hole on the drill press. little tear out at the back but other than that that looks pretty good just giving it a couple coats of lacquer in times of turmoil people turn from what they knew from what they understood and embrace the old ways the old magic they sought relics from rare and highly sought after material <laughs> honestly I I think this qualifies as rare and highly sought after. Toilet paper talisman? <laughs> toilet paper talisman. I'm having a hard time saying the phrase toilet paper talisman with a straight face, but honestly, look at this. It is made from a block of toilet paper, cut on the bandsaw, and finished with spray lacquer. If you don't have to go out, please don't go out. But if you do need to forage in the wild, don't forget to take your toilet paper talisman. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. I will catch you guys next time. <laughs>